वेलकम टू मामा माई स्ट्रेंथ फैमिली डे फ्रेंड्स इफ यू लाइक दिस वीडियो टू सब्सक्राइब लाइक शेयर कॉमेंट एंड हिट द बेल आईकॉन फ्रेंड्स टूडे वी आर ऑन अ रोड ट्रिप टू रिनो एंड दिस इज अ डे ट्रिप सिंपली बिकॉज वी डू नॉट वन स्टे इन द हीट इज इन द एरिया वे आई स्टे द टेम्परेचर इज इन हंड्रेड्स एंड दिस इज गोइंग टू लास्ट फॉर अ वीक सो इट इज वेरी वेरी हॉट वे आई स्टे and sometimes when the heat is uh, very hot or the temperature is very hot outside you will need to stay indoor because um just to protect yourself from heat stroke and in order to stay indoor you will have to use a lot of acs and this can be very costly so you know staying indoor can be very boring which is why my family has decided to take a day trip to reno reno is a city uh, which is part of navada navada is a state and reno is a city that falls in the state area of navada reno is also known as the big little city it is famous for gambling which is why you will find wide variety of casinos here so if you love gambling this is the place where you want to be they have got very beautiful hotels uh together with casinos uh inside it or built around it which is part of the hotel or very much close to the area in which the hotel is located to and if you will see that this particular city has got lot of mountains and it looks very very beautiful the city of navara is well maintained and also if you will go in reno you will see that it's very clean and very beautiful at the same time Here we are approaching the gas station just to get a uh, uh, gas for our vehicle. We are currently using a rental here because if you are trying to travel long distance, people prefer here to use rental rather than their private vehicles. And you can see the scenery is very beautiful. Right now we are um right now you will say that it's afternoon here which is why you are also seeing part of the sunset but it is not fully night here and believe me during winter the whole city is covered in snows and it is very very cold here at the same time you will see that there are road blocks but when it's summer the city looks very beautiful especially at night time it has got beautiful lightnings that brightens up the whole city um right now um since we have our daughter here with us uh just to mention something about us is that kids are not allowed to go in casinos they are not allowed to play any games inside the casino so um if parents are traveling to casinos they might have to carry a babysitter with them or might have to plan a trip whereby uh they might not be allowed to get their kids with them but we have got a particular casino here which is also a hotel it is known as circus circus and circus circus has got a casino for adults and a little gaming area just like chuck e cheese um 
four kids. My daughter has uh, been here since childhood and today we want to take her um, on this surprise trip uh, to Circus Circus provided if it's going to be open then we might go inside. So uh, Circus Circus is is a hotel plus casino plus kids game uh, playing area as well. It's um, very beautiful. It has got beautiful dining area inside and very clean and well maintained. It is located in the um, main city which we are about to approach soon right now you will see that we are in a residential type area which is also surrounded by uh, mountains it's so beautiful in the summer because uh, you don't uh, see the um, night life that quickly in terms of daylight so which is why it is evening already here and you are seeing that it's not fully dark which is the beauty here so normally uh, people like to escape from the city uh, uh, in the weekends just to spend quality time gaming or personal time gambling you know just to relax their mind trying their luck in this city and sometimes even if you play simple games you are able to gain or win money which is good and then on the other hand like i said it's gambling so the chances is always 50 50. i'm not a fan of uh, gambling myself i do not like gambling and i do not like to bet money on any of uh, game facilities um, but uh, um, there are people that like to enjoy these things um, yes, I have been in casinos and um, so has my little child uh, for this particular part of Reno which I am mentioning uh, Circus Circus is very good uh, if you are carrying kids with you you might like to you know um, bring kids to this particular um, casino whereby they can also get a chance to play and win games um, sorry play games and win treasures so as you can see that's slowly getting dark here my daughter is asking us when we will arrive in the main city guys one thing good about uh, when you're traveling here on various spots you will find shopping complex and fast food that you will find almost in all the cities um, but rarely if you are looking for your trash traditional meals such as we are Indians so um, if you're looking for Indian meals you will only have to travel to Pacific location but if you are looking for fast food such as like McDonald's KFC uh, Taco Bell, Beggar King, uh, Popeye, you will find them along um, in complexes because uh, each complex has their own uh, restaurants um, which is very much carrying the uh, similar brand that you will find in almost all the cities so if you are a fan of these foods you will definitely find them and sometimes um, people will say McDonald's Taco Bell uh, these food are not good because they are fast food but hey sometimes they do have salad options and other options that you might like to travel uh, try but guys if you are traveling 
I would suggest that you carry your own personal drinks, uh, snacks for the road, your blanket, your pillow, um, you know, spare clothes, even if it's a day trip, extra shoes, some clothes, you know, um, towel, etc. Because you never know when you will face other scenarios. So it is always wiser if you have vehicles or if you are using a rental and you are a frequent traveler then please pre-pack all your bags and keep keep your gears ready so as if you are supposed to travel you will not uh, miss your items and if you have got kids and you are traveling make sure you carry their medications with you even if they are not sick uh, never know when you will need them and also right now your mask is very important plus your um, hand sanitizer and I prefer to use alcohol sprays well get your own alcohol bottle and use uh, uh, a, a spray bottle that can actually uh, spray well on your hands and areas where you need it so guys you are seeing the tall buildings already some of these tall buildings are hotels like I mentioned they have got casinos you know side by side or maybe uh, located in, within the layers of the hotel like at the bottom you will have casinos and on top you have hotel etc some even have car parks like three layers or four layers and believe me that you are seeing that the road is very much empty uh, I mean like not necessarily empty but the traffic is not that high but if you will notice the cars parked around the hotel are so heavy you will uh, you know you can estimate that there will be a large number of guests already in those uh, hotels and look at the scenery it's so beautiful Yes, we are on the freeway and look at the sun. It's shining right uh, in front of us and it looks so beautiful. Guys, if you have noticed that the sky was little pinkish or reddish, it's not because that my camera was faulty, it is simply because of the heat. imagine that in the snow uh, when it's winter time um, this particular place is all covered in snow so six months you will have this uh, beautiful sunshine and the next few months you will be in uh, facing cold weather uh, will be very difficult for you to get outside people do get outside who are used to uh, winter environment especially uh, when they live in snow areas uh, but if you are not used to it can be very much difficult so here we are taking the exit from the freeway trying to reach to the main city so my uh, suggestion is that if you are a frequent traveler of following areas then always do google search in advance get reviews from youtube or uh, facebook or um, other sites on the food quality so this way when you are traveling you know where to get your meals etc and always have extra water bottles with you because uh, especially in summer here when it's very very hot 
you never know when you need it guys if you are carrying babies or toddlers which uh, I don't have I have a, a, a daughter who is not a toddler anymore and neither she's a baby but if you have babies and toddlers with you and you are a frequent traveler please do not hesitate carry their potty with you in your car because just like us they need to use the bathroom as well the sun uh, light was making uh, driving very difficult here we are stopping at the light and you can see some of the roadblocks due to construction yes we are at the light and we are stopping and you will see that the road is almost empty and that it's almost approaching to uh, um, evening so um, guys if you are enjoying my video please please do comment do share my videos with your friends and families and also don't forget to subscribe like okay if you really think my effort is worth then please do mention it and prove it so here we are in the city of uh, city area right now and you can see the tall beauty uh, buildings and it looks very very beautiful so you can see the gas station also is very much close to us as we enter the main city I am quiet because I want you to view the city area and enjoy the view. So we're trying to locate the this uh, kids casino area and looking for a parking spot. My husband decided just to give her a sup give our daughter a surprise. As you know, kids stay indoor and get bored. Traveling is one way of relaxing your mind because while you are traveling, you wish to listen to good music, and when you see change in your environment your surrounding you know your mood does enhance it also reduces your stress plus uh, the trip to reno was very beautiful because we were connecting with the nature now guys i did not um uh, i mean if you think uh, this is the same scene that she just showed us well guys it's simply because there was a roadblock and we had to make a turn in the same area again which is why you're seeing the same scenario again but notice the vehicles and the first one you were seeing zero vehicles or less vehicles but now you're seeing more we are again going to enter the same city uh, entrance here like I said, we could not find a parking spot. So we are train, uh, trying to return uh, to the same uh, location. A map is very, very handy.
so here you can see that the buildings here are built with uh, um, connecting to each other can you can you see this So friends, we are going in the circle trying to allocate the right parking spot. If we do not find the right parking spot, uh, as we wanted to um, walk around, we'll probably have to use the building a uh, car park. So here you will notice that we have arrived. And this is the car park area. So we'll probably have to park our vehicles inside the building, um, parking build, uh, building while the car cars are parked. And you can see the different layers of car park this particular building has. And it is already um, in the casino complex. You will find a lot of high rise buildings and things here in this particular city like I said it is famous for gambling and it is actually the hub of gambling uh, that's they say that the gambling actually started in this particular uh, city so here we are We had to turn to make uh, our entrance. You will notice that coronavirus is here, but people are still approaching casinos to do their gambling. Like I said, this particular casino building is connected, and you can see uh, that the other side was the hotel now we are entering we are we have a we have our child with us which is why we cannot go to the bottom casino we are only where the kids uh, can hang out this is the area where they can hang out and kids have their own gaming area right now my daughter has is getting a bag because uh, she has got all the items in it which she won while playing those games here we are returning back now we are actually going back home we just brought brought her uh, so that she can enjoy a bit and you know kids once they get their favorite toys etc they don't wish to hang out plus it was getting late uh, at night so um, like I said this was just a day trip and now we are heading home Like I mentioned, we are in the city and look, there again are less vehicles. It's night time and it's a weekend here, but you will see most of the families are not uh, traveling, which is why um, towards the city, which is why you will see that the city is, uh, you know, you can see hardly uh, vehicles around. 
even you will notice that you know there are few people that is working in the city very few but like i said only the casino area has got people inside otherwise on the streets and on the road the vehicles you'll find very less so i would say overall it was not busy now we are traveling just to grab something so that we can have uh, some food to go my family decided to grab some kfc because we were all craving to eat fried chicken and you know sometimes when you cook at home the taste is not that same <laughs> so we are taking an exit out of the freeway oh sorry out of uh, the city into the freeway and here we are on the freeway So friends, in this video, I will be sharing with you some night moment of this particular city, which is known as Reno and part of Nevada. Let me know in my comment section, how was this video? And if you had enjoyed, I can tell that um, during summertime, you will find that the city looks more like a de into a desert area but which is not true is simply because the grasses were dry and deserts are where you will find sand mostly this particular city doesn't well as far as i traveled i didn't see a sandy mountains i did see a uh, dry grasses along with uh, trees with full green leaves which made the nature uh, look so beautiful so you will notice here we have taken another exit just to um, approach a complex where we can find some food for us to go or perhaps eat at the car park so we are again out of the freeway looking for KFC isn't the night so beautiful but believe me it's from the vehicle it looks beautiful from outside it also looks beautiful but the difference is that inside the vehicle it is beautiful but you have ac inside and outside the vehicle it looks beautiful but the heat is just unbearable so this particular area you will also find uh, residential housing along the mountainside which is good because you also have some complexes um, for food and shopping around plus nearby food area So friends, here we have allocated a KFC. As you can see, we are now making a turn further up. That's the KFC building. We'll actually be using the drive through
you will be noticing uh, that because it's a mountain area you will be seeing us traveling up and down you will notice that uh, this is a different state so you do have a border checking in the sense if you are crossing states into another state you will be checked and in some places you are you have to uh, pay a certain fee like uh, for bay area or san francisco area they do charge money and others do inspect especially if you are using a private vehicle or uh, if you are using a rental yeah we are on the drive through i know the wait was long so right now we are going back going back home And this time I'm gonna leave the video on you guys so you can watch and enjoy the nightlife here. While we return back home. So the day was very beautiful. We enjoyed a lot. Uh, it was um, you know a different experience because mostly people like to do shopping uh, travel to shopping areas but we saw a lot of shopping areas we uh, prefer to go. Um, travel in the areas where we can see mountains a um, lot of trees forest area you know just for a change and to get the freshness uh, from the environment and enjoy its beauty. So friends, if you will notice, we are still in the residential area. Now we will be connecting back into the freeway which is ahead of us soon it's gonna be dark and making videos may not be that possible so I would have to you know uh, leave my video and vlogging with you guys at this spot and allow you guys to enjoy the night uh, uh, traveling in this particular video as you can see when we were coming to Reno there was less traffic now we are returning back home and traffic is coming this is simply because i have already mentioned to you guys that people love to come to this particular place just to enjoy the nightlife here on the other side you will be seeing the residential areas we are going up the mountain then down the mountain then up the mountain and down the mountain because Reno is surrounded by beautiful mountains so friends if you have enjoyed the video please don't forget to subscribe like share and comment
Thank you for watching.